power off. So I'm revisiting an older hilt that I reviewed some time ago. This is the Kishi by uh, the Patch Store. I'm considering upgrading it. Not this particular hilt because I actually like the soundboard on this thing. Um, it, it kind of performs like an Asteria. Uh, I believe it has six fonts. I'll go through each of the fonts. Fonts. It has color changing. Um, uh, has blaster deflect, flash on clash, lock up, the, the whole gambit. But it's, it's a really efficient and gratifying soundboard and a really loud um, chassis. There is actually um, a removable chassis in here. The whole shroud is removable. And again, this is just sort of an update of an existing uh, review. You can see that this uh, removes and you've got your um, lithium-ion 18650 battery and the uh, soundboard is, uh, there's the soundboard and there's a uh, removable uh, micro SD card right there. And this whole chassis just kind of slides right in. It's not in the stereo heart, but I really like this thing. And you'll recognize the boot up sound immediately and probably most of the sound fonts. Boot. Obviously, there's no smooth swing. This was released prior to the advent of smooth swing. And when you put it into deep sleep mode, power off. Really, really crisp and efficient. Plus, the uh, hilt itself is sort of a nickel-plated, silky smooth finish. And um, I just, I've enjoyed this hilt for so long. And it's been such a, a stalwart um, that, yeah, I, I'm eventually going to probably upgrade it and get one with either Profi or uh, the um, Asteria 2.5. But in the meantime, I'm perfectly happy with the soundboard and... Uh, Boot. The different fonts. And you can 
of course, you know, you can swap out the sound fonts. I'm not sure exactly what's compatible with the soundboard. Um, you know, I, I I'd highly doubt that newer uh, sound fonts in CFX or, um, you know, Profi format would, would be compatible. But then again, I'm not an expert on such things uh, since the soundboard is a couple years old. But to be perfectly honest, I've never updated it because I love all the sound fonts on the thing. I really love the way they all perform in this particular board. It's very responsive, very loud. Um, if if I could put the soundboard into two thirds of my sabers, I, I probably would. Um, I really thought, you know, I still think that this is a, a real winner. Um, the Asteria that came with my uh, RVS did, didn't really impress me too much, but I'm hoping uh, when I get my Highborn uh, with the uh, Asteria 2.5 that will um, hopefully uh, be a lot more impressive. So anyway, I uh, hope you liked uh, this revisit to the uh, the Kishi. Like I said, it's an older style hilt, but it's, it's been in my collection for since pretty much the beginning. This is one of the very first custom sabers I ever bought, and it's held up flawlessly. Um, so it's a, a real win from uh, the patch store. So anyway, I hope you liked the, uh, hope you liked the showcase and the... Uh, and revisiting the saber so if you have any questions regarding uh, the kishi please hit me up in the comments um, like and subscribe and uh, until I see you guys in the next video may the force be with you and uh, hope everyone is uh, is doing okay take care now bye bye